Hey, if you're tired of playing open chords and you want to learn some chords up the neck, then you're in the right place because that's coming up. Hello and welcome to Your Guitar Guide, the channel where I'm going to help you find your sound with guitar lessons, music, and gear reviews. If this is your first time here, consider subscribing. And if you've already subscribed, thank you very much. Today, it's your lucky day, we're going to learn how to play easy chords up the neck. And the chords that we're going to start with are the D, and then the A, and the E. So we go to D, D, A, E. So let's see how to play the D chord. An open D chord is picking the uh, open D string. Your first finger will be on the G string, third string at the second fret. Second finger will be at the second fret of the E string. And your third finger will be at the third fret of the B string. And when you play the D chord, you're going to strum from the fourth string down. Then the next chord is the A chord. Open A string is included in making playing the open A chord. So we've got a fifth string, and then three fingers are going to be on strings four, three, and two of the second fret. That's the A, open A chord. So we got. Then we're going to do the E chord. First finger will be on the uh, G string at the first fret. And then the second fret of the A string, you, you'll place your second finger right under that. Put your third finger at the second fret of the D string. Alright, if you want to learn that strumming pattern, country style, check out that video right there. But now, if you don't want to just sit and play chords in the open position, we can move them up the neck. So those are the three chords we're going to move up the neck. And if you really want to open up the neck to thousands of chords, then take a look at the courses over at yourguitarguide.com. Okay, so we're going to play a D chord. Maybe you're used to playing a B chord in the first position here. It's that same position. We're going to move it up to the D. How do we know it's a D? It's a D because we know how to find the notes on the fretboard. And check out the courses. I'll show you how. Okay, so your first finger is going to be on the fifth string at the fifth fret. And then your third finger is going to bar D, G, and B string. Check out that video there for fretting hand technique. And it'll give you all the tips to make it easier to play that chord. So you're not killing yourself trying to hold the strings down. Then the next chord we're going to play is the A chord. So we had the D down here, then we had the A. Now we're going to play the A here. And now we're 
get into bar chords. Bar chords. Over at yourguitarguide.com, I've got a complete lesson on bar chords, so check that out. But basically, on the fifth fret, see, we're just moving everything up from here to the sixth string. So we're going to bar all the strings on the fifth fret. And then your third finger will be on the seventh fret of the fifth string. Your pinky is going to be on the seventh fret of the fourth string. And then on the G string at the sixth fret is your second finger. So that's an A. Practice playing the A. And the D. But if you want to play it country style, pick the fifth string, strum, sixth string, strum. Then if we're going to play the A country style, pick the sixth string, strum, fifth string, strum. going to play the E. So we played the D, A, E. Now we're playing the D, A, E. So this D here, if you just move it up two frets, now you're playing the E. And to play it country style, you're Playing it the same way as the D. Five, six, five. You don't have to start on the D, you can start on A. D, E, A. This is just one way to play chords up the neck. If you missed it, check out that video lesson on other chords that you can play up the neck. And I'll see you next time. Thanks.